I would understand as Israel, I must be responsible with my massive military might to make sure I don't kill civilians. And I would sit and try and make a measured response and I'd be a professional and I would consider them human beings and I would secure my border and try and come up with a plan better than, oh no, I'm mad, I'm emotional now, let's go kill everyone. I think that's the wrong response. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Bismillah rahman rahim Welcome back to the Straight Pad Podcast. And in today's video, we will be analyzing the exchange between Andrew Tate and Piers Morgan, in which Andrew Tate makes such a difficult point for Piers Morgan to counter that he changes the topic. Piers Morgan had broken the episode down into two parts. Basically, one, he covers um, Andrew Tate's basically personal life and everything. And in the second part, he covers um, Palestine with him. So at the end, Andrew Tate makes such a good and solid point. Piers Morgan has to change the topic back to Andrew Tate's possessions being taken away and his court date in the Romanian courts which wasn't supposed to happen. Piers Morgan made a point to do that because he had a very difficult time countering the point Andrew Tate made. So let's listen to what Brother Tate had to say. Just like I said earlier, when I'm trying to be responsible about what I say to the young men of the world, I would understand as Israel, I must be responsible with my massive military might to make sure I don't kill civilians. And I would sit and try and make a measured response and I'd be a professional and I would consider them human beings and I would secure my border and try and come up with a plan better than, oh no, I'm mad. I'm emotional now. Let's go kill everyone. I think that's the wrong response. Correct. I don't think I don't think that's the right thing to do. Tate makes a very good point that Israel's response is just emotional. If you have such military might, if you have such good spying apparatuses, this shouldn't be the response. You have to take a measured response. You have to learn from the mistakes of other countries and other nations that they made and go from there. But Israel did absolutely the opposite of that. We've spent a long time talking. Um, you're going to find out at some stage today or in the next few days whether you're going to get your possessions back. That will either happen or not happen. Piers Morgan, <laughs> he refuses to answer that. He's like, you're going to find out whether you're going to, you're going to get your possessions back or not. That, that, that wasn't the response Andrew Tate was expecting. Andrew Tate makes this excellent strong point. And Piers Morgan's like, well, now it's time to change the topic. Like, really? Come on, Piers. SubhanAllah, man. Y you see the hypocrisy of the media, even members of the media who are trying to be balanced, such as Piers Morgan says he is. The hypocrisy is appalling. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give us tawfiq. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala continue to strengthen our brothers who are speaking out for our innocent Palestinian brothers and sisters who are being slaughtered on a daily basis. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect the ummah. Jazakallah khair. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.